Do it for Dale. I'm doing it for Dale. Fire me up. <laughs> Welcome back to RDR and Project Dreamcatcher, episode two. Before we get started, we want to bring your attention to merch. Check it out. Check Please it see out. the link below. This is just one of our multiple designs more that we the, have. Think of this as more of the shop shirt. Yeah. American built. American built. Flag on American the side. American flag. I'm going to tell you something. You're going to feel real patriotic working on anything you do wearing this. Oh, yeah. This you're is... Gonna, you're going to feel like America. <laughs> I already feel like America, America right now. America. I feel American. <laughs> do you guys remember on the last episode with uh, Project Dreamcatcher, episode one, you can link uh, here at the end of the video. You can watch it. Um, we got her out. We got her started. We cleaned her up. Mm -hmm. And we actually had some success that we weren't expecting no I'd, I'd say so, surprised yeah actually very surprised yeah. so we're hoping we're, we're gonna build on that success today please, um, please. yeah <laughs> I'm praying for it to <laughs> yeah. stay yeah, please all that kind of stuff as you can see she's filled back up but these are all parts for project green bean if you're interested in that also link below mm -hmm. go ahead and click on that and watch please don't forget to subscribe and like that's what grows our channel and that's the help we need yeah we need all the help we do <laughs> need all the help all right let's get started all right, first thing we're gonna do, fam, is try to get it backed up. I'm gonna have Ike stay in the truck. You stay, stay in the truck. Stay, stay, stay. Right. Yep. Right. And we'll see if we can't get it moved out enough to test the brakes to see how that pedal feels, see if it feels weird. What you're checking for is any like weird feedback it gives you. Like, like it's too high, it's too low, it catches, mm -hmm. it jerks, you know, anything that yeah. doesn't feel like a smooth transition. All right. Can we get fuel in it from here? No. Too tight. Too tight. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna sneak behind the truck, or I guess in front of the truck. Yeah, I'm trying to run or you I'm over. I'm gonna stand behind the truck and pull. I don't remember. <laughs> uh, one of those. Yeah, I'm not getting in front of it. <laughs> That's for sure. Uh, it's in gear. You want me to hold the brakes and take it out, or uh, just put it in neutral? Yeah. <laughs> the not, my foots are not on the brake. Don't like, worry. Did this truck gain a thousand pounds? <laughs> what yeah. the hell? Oh. Hit the brakes yet? Yeah, go ahead. Oh, that's that did not. That just stopped by itself. It stopped by itself. I don't think the brakes did anything. Really? I was by by the time I was at the very end, it started to to get some kind of catch. Hmm. Let me see how far back we are. All right. Hmm. Well, we're going to have to keep coming out with it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, are you confident they'll stop? If I really, I think if I, like, mm -hmm. really, really try, I might be able to. Yeah. If emergency, I just crank on the e-brake or put it in gear. Yeah, just push the e-brake down or put it in gear. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll just. Okay. Yeah. You'd step on the pedal. Yeah. All right, so if, if these brakes ain't working, and if that don't work, I'm shoving it into gear. That's our emergency action plan. <laughs> All right, we're going to at least get her booty out. Okay, are the wheels straight? Because mm. the wheels, this yeah, is, wheels are straight. This is turned. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Straight enough. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Tell me when. <laughs> I just want it out far enough to put some gas in it. Yeah, we're getting close to the, uh, like right, right there. Try the brake. You gotta really, this is, I am all the way down. All the way down. And it locked up. Okay, go ahead and put it in gear. Let's get some gas in this thing. Oh, stand back. Hey, go ahead. All right, there we go. Holy moly. Hey guys, these brakes. These brakes are shot. It's kind of what I was afraid of. Yeah. The brakes being. They were just a little bit shot. It's all right though. It is all right. I agree. Got um, our NASCAR yeah. fuel, fuel thingy. Our fuel system. Yeah. I had never. Yeah, how do you put that on? I was I looking know. at that, and it's kind of, it's kind of weird. 
Somebody should have Googled this first. Yeah. I wonder who that was. <laughs> How does it? Just a good question, Val. Hmm. I feel like that should go in there. Mm hmm. That makes sense. Like it looks like a, a turn. All right, so as you know, so many experiences here for RDR, they're new to us. Yeah. Like we've never had that kind of a fuel can, uh, mm -hmm. you'll see. It turns out like we've got a half inch drive ratchet right in oh. there. That, hurt. that works. And, and out it comes. So if you ever get one, that's the way to get this little guy out. See, we didn't need Google. Need Who are Google. we? Screw Google. No Google needed. All right. Let's drop our hose in here. Nice. And then we will get it back on the can and then um, spill it all down the side of the truck. Yeah, and then on your fingers too. Yeah. Do you have a cut or should we cut your finger? Yeah, if you could get a knife so we could get a pretty okay. deep cut. Or you know what? Actually would feel better if we could cut my fingernails like really short. Oh, if you take them off and then? Mm -hmm. Or just as short as we can. And then, oh, that'd, yeah. that'd feel good, yeah. Mm. And then a cut too, that'd right. be a nice mix. Yeah. <laughs> God, you're so lucky you get to go through that. I am so lucky. I wish it was yeah. me. I mean, you, uh, you definitely have a shot out of it if you like. <laughs> you just got a crescent wrench on the rest of this to, to get it seated. Tightener it. I think you got it. Yeah. Man, I have not, I haven't stood in this spot right here since <laughs> this truck was in. Since ever? Yeah, since <laughs> ever, ever. It's like the nicest part of the garage now. It is, it's still clean. <laughs> when, with, when we get done with this truck, we're gonna have to film like redoing the floors. Yeah, yeah. with the, the cleaner, the All chemical right. cleaner. Five and a half gallons, Let's see where that gets Let's us. baby up. Oh God, uh oh. <laughs> Don't die. Okay. Is it filling? Mm hmm Nice. So we're thinking this thing probably has no fuel in it right do a, now. Do a close-up of that stream, it's cool. Oh, that's super cool. Yeah. Look at the gas go in. It smells like uh, gas. It smells like money. <laughs> this truck will take the whole thing. Oh, jeez. And we're up the pressure on Put it on turbo. Yeah. Turbo fuel. <laughs> this one's got twin turkeys. Twin turkeys. That's a lot of bald eagle juice going in there. <laughs> bald eagle juice. <laughs> I wonder how many bald eagles they had to squeeze to death to get this. Well, let's think that's five and a half gallons. And uh, so like, that's like one and a half eagles. About so, mm -hmm. yeah. Poor eagle. <laughs> Probably. I don't know. I don't even know if that's the, maybe. Maybe like 19. Mm -hmm. I'd be shocked if it was bigger than that. For the 30 gallon tank in for this trip. For this trip, that'd be sweet. This truck was designed for two fuel tanks. Oh, yeah, isn't there a... Right up, yeah, right up the panel here. Yeah. All right, we'll go for yeah. another one. Yeah, may not be a bad idea. Considering this thing has 410 gears, runs about 55 miles an hour, I predict it'll take us about 61 days to get to Arizona from here. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. that's, that's about right. And about, about a college fund's worth of money in gas. Yep. All for the content. So well worth it. Well worth it. Yeah, this is going to be the, the longest trip this truck's ever been through. Mm-hmm. That's it. One more gas. One more. If you're considering a fuel can, go with the VP. Yeah. It's the only way to go. Yeah. They're like 40 bucks at AutoZone. <laughs> They're not bad. Yeah, no. Five and a half gallons. Yeah. 
get you going anywhere. Hey, we're gonna bring that with us on the trip too. We're keeping that in the bed. Oh yeah. Somewhere and filled with gas. Oh yeah. Oh, this looks so enticing. All right, next on the agenda, I can want you to see if we can get some fuel running through this pump. Mm -hmm. um, now turn that we it have on. it. So get in. Just turn it once so the... Just, yeah, just turn the key to... Let me get the battery hooked up. Okay. I'm gonna put the positive on the negative again. Isn't that how it's supposed to? Yeah. Plus on minus, minus on plus? Yes. That's what, that's what you taught me, so. <laughs> it is what I taught you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay, do the lights come on? Uh, yep. There's a light in here. Turn the headlights on. All right, looks good. Okay. All right, just turn the key, let the pump run. All right. Is there any fuel getting through that uh, filter? Uh, can't tell. Not yet. Man, we have got to replace this filter. Did we get another one? Um. Let me check. Or you made I don't remember us doing that. Maybe not. I know we got a new oil filter. I'm not seeing any juice being propelled <laughs> into the filter. Try to start it. Just a quick. Yeah. Okay, keep trying. Okay, you can stop there. Nothing? Mm-mm. Hmm. All right, so. No fuel. Okay, come on out, buddy. And grab a Phillips screwdriver. Put it back in gear. Nah. Oh, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. Use your man muscles. Oh, he's coming. All right. Oh, that was so nasty. God. You know what? Go ahead and just. All right. Now go back in the truck. You got a cup to put on there? Mm mm. You want fuel spraying? I want fuel spraying. You want? I want it. I want it all. You want to grab a. Mm -hmm. All right, just a quick. Uh, Let's wing it. <laughs> tell me when to turn it off. Yep. Ready? Go for it. Let's stop. Stop. Okay, down the problem. Fuel filter. It's the fuel filter. It's not letting anything through. Oh, we got it, gas everywhere, dude. Nice. Yes, man, it shot out awesome. <laughs> yep. So that's just the old clock. Yep. So this filter. So let's What's that. Take him off there too. So we take out the whole thing if you want where my screwdriver at here it is and we got feel everywhere now yeah we're gonna start it it's gonna go boom mm. it smells like old i know it smells like varnish huh? yeah that's all right we'll get it run through all right pull that thing off come out yeah Get up in there. Yeah. Get up in there. <laughs> oh, this, is, <laughs> this is precarious. Yeah, just a bit. Come on now. Come on now, boy. Do it for Dale. I'm doing it for Dale. Fire me up. <laughs> <laughs> Holy moly. All right, try to take it off from the other end, there, from the carb. Man, old Whitey just doesn't want to be worked on. Mm -hmm. God, it's right. spilling everywhere. That's yeah, all right. Pull it right off of there. All right, and take it out into the street. In the street? Yep. Oh, yeah. Nice. I like the gas all in my hands. Yeah. Feels good. Yep. It smells good, too. Mm hmm There's gas in this line. Hmm. All right. We'll be right back. 
Next step is getting this replaced. Um, we'll have to get to Napa to get one of these replacements, but for now, we're just gonna use this one and making sure we have the arrow pointed the right way. Towards see the that? Towards the carburetor. <laughs> yep. And uh, we'll see if we can't get her started. Look at the difference. That one's nasty. Know, that's On the so right gross, is. isn't it? It's just a little disgusting. Just a little bit. Actually, let's drain some of this out of the tank. We'll use the old. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so let's clear, let's clear the tank a little bit. <clears throat> IQ hop in. Nasty fuel. And you'll just have to turn the key. Um, Ow. Yep, just cut myself. It's all right. Hold on a second. This is not working like I thought it would. Why not? Um, this hose ain't fucking long enough. Do we? Okay, hold on. What not work? What happened? We're gonna have to put this one on first and then drain some of it. What? Because this hose is too short oh. to get into there. Mm -hmm. So we're just mm. gonna have to. What if we, what if, what if, what if, what if, where is it? This right here? Oh no, that's, that's too much work. All right. Are we missing another fucking clamp? We should have one, two. There's one right here. There's one. Oh, yeah, down there. It's All right. All right. Let's get it hooked up. Go ahead and set. Tighten that sucker down. <clears throat> Thing's huge. Yeah. Compared to the. Uh, it is. Fitting. It's not. It's not great. It's not ideal. No. It'll work for now. I don't know if that's going in yep. anymore. That looks good. Okay. Dope. There you go. Put that one on. Here's your other clamp. This was here. Mm hmm Turny, twisty guy. Goes on the carburetor. Goes on Mr. Carb. Yeah, but we're not going to need him yet. Because we're going to oh, drain some of this yeah. fuel. So. All right. Yep. Yeah. All right, that's going to have to work. Okay, you hop in, <clears throat> Let's give it a test run. Tell me if fuel goes everywhere. <clears throat> Ready? Yep. Oh, I see it filling. Nice. It's leaking that's a little good. bit. Good, picking up particles. The fuel's nice and clear. Go ahead and turn it off, buddy. We are in business. Nice. I only leaked a little bit. Huh? It only leaked a little bit. It actually only did leak a little bit, but From it the did top. leak. Huh? From the top. Yeah. Top and bottom. Oh, okay. Oh, cool. We'll see. It's good well, enough to... Again, this, this will just get us through for the moment. Yeah. And then we'll, we'll put a better solution in place tomorrow. I saw it. That thing filled up fast. Yeah. That's some good... That's a good sign. That's some good work right there, boy. Tell you what. Well, no Ike is getting that situated back on there. <laughs> we'll um, see if we can't get a nice little clean start and see if we can't move it forward. Just see if it goes. Yeah, just see if it'll on its own power it'll go. It's then yeah. We'll tackle the brake situation. That's tight. Okay. <sighs> see if you can start it. All right. We'll see. Take yeah. it out of gear. This thing's probably gonna roll. No, I got a chalk block on it. Oh, okay. Yep. Should be okay. All right, you ready? Yep, fire it. Oh, hey, turn it off. Yep, I saw that. Yeah. All right, that ain't gonna work. Where did it spray from? Everywhere. <laughs> well, that's good. None of those fittings are holding. Well, that's great. So we're gonna have to replace them all. Back to Napa. So, back to Napa. It's another day in the garage, guys. Back to Project Dreamcatcher. We're gonna push the old girl out again. Yep. And uh, try to get back to work. Here we go. Mm -hmm. I may have tetanus, but that's fine. I wouldn't worry about it. Yeah, it's all good. It's not AIDS. No. <laughs> I'll live. <sighs> all right. Oh, that back pedal is in mm. neutral. Ready? Yep. All right.
You okay? Yep, just... Yeah, I got a little space over here. You got some space? Yeah, it's just because we're so close to the... Mm -hmm. On this side, okay. we're at a real, real weird angle. They go straight. Right, there we go, yep. Okay, ready? We'll take it. All right, we're gonna leave it right there. You still have to get out on the other side. Huh? Still have to get out over here. Rats, all right. Uh. All right, while Ike gets this light hooked up, I'm gonna put the rest of the gas in her. And we'll get to messing with that carburetor. Mm -hmm. That nasty fuel. As you may have seen from the last little video, we had a bit of a fuel leak. A little bit. So Ike's gonna get it cleaned up. We're gonna replace that fuel filter and uh, see if we can't get that sealed off at least long enough to, to run and drive. We're still on a mission today to get this thing out on the road. Yes. And uh, hopefully get Ike's first lesson on the stick. I cannot wait. Let's see where this goes. All right, so we went to Napa and we got another filter, an actual one. And we're just gonna, we're just gonna go ahead and put it on there. So arrow towards carburetor, don't forget that. Let's get this thing, get this baby on. New fuel filter installed. Just give her a test run. Give her a test run, start her up. Yep, start her up. If she runs, do I just let her? Mm-hmm, let her purr. Purr for a minute or two. Mm-hmm. All right, let's see if this, this old baby runs. Ready? Turn the key and let the fuel pump run for a minute. Does it look like it's not leaking? Yep, it's filling up. Hit the key. Hmm. You're gonna wanna pump it. Okay, hold on. Hold the throttle down. Huh? Hold the throttle down. Okay. And just keep pumping it. There you go. Keep pumping. Now try. A little bit of gas smell. She's running a little rich, but to be considered since she's been sitting for a while. But she runs. That's all that matters. She runs. She runs. Listen, listen to that. Listen is that to her? That what about over here? Stinky. Yeah, just a little smoky. First time she's actually been able to idle for. It's like time. a 5.9 coming swap. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Actually, guys, we do have a surprise in store for this old girl when we get back from our long trip. We'll let you help us decide what our direction is going to be, but we've got some good ideas in, oh, yeah. in mind. We'll see. Man, she started right up. Yeah, she did. Runs like a top. Check her oil. That power steering? Yeah. Do we have it? It's full. Full? Yeah. Did we fill it? I don't remember filling it. I don't either. Where's the dipstick on this thing? Right here. Way down there. See him? Where at? 
Oh yeah. I'm down there. Yeah. Wipe it off. Yeah. Be careful. Looks good. Looks yeah. cool. It's, it's not that dark either. It looks actually like yeah, it actually looks the good. Past, yeah. The past little while. Oh god. There we go. All right, dream catcher, old whitey. Old dream catcher. Huh? Old dream catcher. Yeah. He is definitely catching some dreams. <laughs> it's starting to smell better. I mean, it's still it's like gas, but it's not as bad. True. Well, let me, let me back her up. Touch these brakes, see what they're yeah. feeling like. If Might, we have brakes, close the mirror on that side. Okay. <clears throat> All right, we're gonna go ahead and. Uh, I mean, she, she's running, so we're gonna go ahead and back her up at this point, or try to back her out under our own power. Mm -hmm. Test these brakes as best we can, as safely as we can, yeah. and then go from there. I got a <laughs> feeling that. Uh, these brakes are probably pretty bad, but just when we were rolling it out, they felt horrible, like they weren't doing anything. Yeah, so, so we're gonna have to mess with that. All right, so let's give this a shot. Um, yeah, I'll be at the wheel. It's clear on that side. How do they feel? They feel locked up. Locked up? Yeah, they feel like they're just on. Like on all the time? Yeah, like I'm not on the brake. And look, we should be rolling back. Yeah. Like at least quickly rolling back. It's just back. creeping. Yeah, it's just creeping, so hop in. Let me get a little walk around real quick. All right. Is that your dog? Is that your shepherd down there? Is that a black shepherd? Oh, shit. Is that Rena, dude? Is it? Our neighbor? All right, guys, after our dog ran away. Oh my God. So I don't know if you saw that, but that is Rena. And our mailman, awesome, came over and told us our dog got loose. She's a rescue and she is, she's a good girl, but she does have her tendencies like all German Shepherds do. But the one thing she has that works in our favor is FOMO. And uh, so if you start calling her, she gets a little too far, she comes right back. like. She's actually probably one of the best trail dogs I've ever had, like hiking. Mm -hmm. uh, I can let her off leash and she'll run through the woods. I can lose track of her. Whistle a few times and she'll come right back to me, so. Oh, Rena. We don't like her getting out, but if she does, she will come back. <laughs> Love her. Everyone we got a crew Rina. of misfits. Yeah. We got a pit bull. We got a chihuahua. <laughs> a cat. <laughs> There's just one of everything. It, it, it's eclectic, I'd say. <laughs> Think about it, we got it. Yeah, we got it. We're all shop dogs, guys, yeah. don't worry. Yeah, shop cat, shop dogs. Yeah, shop cat, he's cool. Bubbles. All right, we are missing a tie down on this battery, but I think we're gonna wing it for just the purposes of testing these brakes. I think that master cylinder's head, let's check the fluid on it. Yeah, yeah. have we even looked at that yet? No. Well, plenty of fluid. Is there? Looks yeah. disgusting, but. Yeah. That is gross. <laughs> okay, let's give it another shot. Let's test it. <clears throat> Whew. Man, this truck hasn't been driven in years, guys. She's finally getting her, her maiden voyage. That's loud. That far out enough for you, or oh, it ain't gonna matter much for what see. it is. It's way too far, actually. 
I can't see. These mirrors suck ass. My dad <laughs> hated these motherfuckers. Did he put them on or who put them? Are these stuck? No, they came like this, yeah. You don't see them too often on these things, but... I've never seen them on a... Mm-hmm. On the truck. They're hard as hell to see out of and... You can't move them. Can't move the damn things. You gotta undo all the bolts and the rest <laughs> it all to hell, so... <sighs> Add that to the whiteboard. Yep. Oh, my God. We'll be showing you that later, too. Yeah. All right, let's give this thing a shot. Look at there. That started right up. That was... You know what? You know what Ford stands for? Stands for? Fix it again, Tony. Fix it again, Tony. <laughs> right? <laughs> no, Dale. Dale, that's, that's Fiat. Fiat, Dale. All right, let's see. <laughs> yeah, slam. Oh, look at that. These brakes are they're they're locked up. There's look, no he's, point. He's not on the not on the brake. Oh yeah, they're We're locked not going up somewhere. Anywhere. Oh yeah, they're. Yeah. yeah, I think the rods pushed in on that. Master oh, All right, well, we have a new one. Let's get after it. All right. 